We play. We fight. We conquer. Welcome to The Freak Show. I am your host, Bumpy McSquiggums, and today we take a first look at Monster Sanctuary. It is currently in Steam Early Access. It entered into Steam Early Access on August 28th, 2019, so it's been around for about a year. I'm just getting to it now. I know I'm a terrible human person. I am sorry. It is by, and I'm sure I'm going to butcher this, Moira, or Moirai, I, I get nothing, Games and Team 17 Digital Limited. Uh, I've had this on my to-do list for a very long time. I'm trying to get through some of that to-do list, and here we are. So we're going to throw a first look at it, and maybe once this game comes out, if I really, really like it when we play it here, um, maybe when it comes out fully out of early access, maybe we'll hop in and we'll play it as a national series. I don't know. Thoughts on a postcard, please, or comment section, if you will. All right, new game. Never played this. Don't know what I'm doing. It's going to be an experience. Oh, God. All right, there we go. I could be the old guy with the beard or the possibly young girl without the beard. All right, we're going to go with the old guy with the beard. What is my name? My name is Cordy. I can't type. Ah, oh. oh, you, you, you wound me, sir. You wound me. We're just going to go old school bumpy. We just go on bumps this time. You know how we do. This game looked really cool, so it, but it's been a long time. Monster Sanctuary is a land far from any other human civilization. Uh-huh. 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 Uh while, while wild monsters are dangerous to humans, monsters raised by them grow loyal to their owners. Very nice. Saving. Dot, dot, dot. Most of the people of the monster sanctuary live in the Keeper's stronghold. Many of them learn to raise and train monsters. Like the little mushroom demon who could. They call themselves Monster Keepers. Cool. I'm digging the whole monster thing. I mean, I should probably just go monster, but it's all good. Choose the familiar of your bloodline. The spectral wolf with attack and magic and defense and health and mana. And there's water and wind. The fire and wind. The spectral eagle. The, the spectral toad. And then the spectral lion. Seems like the eagle's like the big uh, meanie poo of the, the group. Uh, we're going to go with the toad. We don't do a lot of attack, but we have decent defense and health. Eh. Yeah, spectral toad. we got to go with that green. we got to keep it green, guys and gals. Um, amongst the most prestigious of monster keepers, there are four prominent old bloodlines tied to the monster sanctuary's history. Each of those bloodlines is aided by a spectral familiar. I don't know why I can't talk. I'm pretty tired. Maybe that has something to do with it. We'll see. I was hoping this game would bring me... Those familiars are ageless protectors of the family. They passed on from one keeper to the next. I'm hoping this game would bring me out of my tiredness. I think it might. Bumpy is just starting out to become a monster keeper like his ancestors before him. As with all starting monster keepers, his journey begins on the keeper's trail. This bloodline's familiar bears the form of a spectral... Oh. Name your familiar. Uh, We're just going to name him Tommy the Toad. He's Tommy the Toad. Oh, yeah, Tommy the Toad. Monsters are wild things. The only reason I'm helping you is the bond I share with your family. Most monsters are less inclined than me to help you. That is why you must always raise your own monsters. They will grow alongside you. Just as I will. And they will fight for you. The best way to gain a monster's loyalty is to hatch it from its egg. Of course, you will have to fight to get those monster eggs. Look at that blob over there. What's up, blob? Initiate a fight by contact. We shall see if you will live up to your ancestors. Ooh, what this? Okay, unexpected. Choose monsters. Start combat. You know it's funny. I just never mind. Never mind. All right, we got mud cannon. We got bubble burst, and we got t -t 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 tackle. We can rearrange with S. I don't know what that means. Um, okay, we see how much. So it looks like bubble burst is the one that's gonna do the most damage. Um, I don't really care. Let's just do this. Eh, sure. Blah. 
Oh, I had it backwards. It's just gonna do the least damage. Let's hit him with the mud cannon. Get him! Muddy, muddy, muddy. Slam shot. Ooh, that actually hurt a little bit. Oh no, we're poisoned. Tackle's not gonna do. It. Tackle might do it. I mean, it's gonna do a decent amount of damage. Hadouken. Slime shot. All right. This is kind of cool. I like this. So I just recently played my first Pokemon-esque game. It's called uh, Nexomon Extinction. So it's funny that I just chose to play this game immediately after, and like I recorded it. I don't think I've uploaded it yet. I haven't uploaded it yet. And uh, this is kind of the second one, I guess, that's similar to that. Though I've never played a Pokemon game, so I have no idea. But I can only assume. Alright, cool. So we did this thing. So I guess we gather, raise, train monsters, and fight them. There we go. You received a blob egg. Now you need to hatch it. Now you need to hatch it. Now you need to hatch it. Open your inventory menu and try to hatch it. Hatch it, hatch it, hatch it, hatch it, hatch it. Inventory. Blob egg. Hatch the egg to receive a blob. Yeah. We got a blob. Oh, yeah. That's cool. Oh, we get to name the blob. Hmm. He's going to be Bobbington the Blob. Maybe I should make him Blobbington. No, Bobbington the Blob. I like it. Tommy the Toad, Blobbington the Bob. Uh, the bo Bobbington the Blob. I knew I was going to say it backwards. That is your first monster you've hatched by yourself. Right now it is weak. You will need to train it. There is much more for you to learn, too. You and that Blob are quite alike. Let's continue on the Keeper's Trail. It would lead us to Old Buran, an old friend of mine. He is a patient teacher to all young Keepers who seek guidance. I advise you to listen to him very carefully. You know, you're kind of snarky, Tommy. I'm not real sure I'm a big fan of you, buddy. Hello, Blobby. Let's fight again. Do we have... Oh, we have two Blobbers. Oh, we're fighting two Blobbers. Oh, no. All right, we have Arcane Bolt. Yeah, get Arcane. All right, let's hit him with the tackle. T -t 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 tackle. Yeah, what are you gonna do? You gonna attack my Blobby? Nope, you're gonna have to Toadman. Mr. Toady Toadman. Ooh, double toading it up. All right, cool, 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 cool. All right, Arcane Bolt. Uh, I'm gonna stay on the back line. Bloop, 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 bloop. And Mud Cannon won't take you, but the Tackle might. We're, we're going to see. It did not. Oh, you're going to heal. Oh, you're just going to make a mockery of this. All right. Well, I say that I am also going to heal. What do you think of that? Look at that. All that hard work you guys just did? Nothing. Ain't no thing. You gonna throw a hit? No. He doesn't care about his compatriot. He's just like, I'm all about what I'm doing right now, and nothing else matters. Alright. Absolutely crushed him. I'm a little disappointed, though. I'm not gonna lie, I was expecting a bit more out of, uh, like, the other attacks from Tommy. I figured we could probably finish that guy off, but nope. All are healed. I know I don't have to do that. I just want to do Bubble Burst because I haven't seen it yet. Oh, that's super lame. He's very strong against that, apparently. Alright, let's put this fool down. Hadouken! There it is. The Hadouken of Doom. The Hadouken of Destiny. Alright, we got a 2-star rare loot chance, 30%, 110 gold bonus. We got 15 gold and a small potion. Oh, that's weak. We didn't get any eggs for that? Come on, man. Based on the effectiveness of your combat strategy, you'll get a rating of 1 to 5 stars. Earning a higher rating increases your chances of getting better drops, like rare monster eggs. Alright, that's that's fine. I like that it's kind of a platformer. I, I guess it breaks up the, the normal, like, top-down, isometric type situation. This is, uh, this is good. Alright, let's see what this thing is. All right, a magma pillar and a rocky. All right. You're weak against water. 
And you're weak against fire. You're resistant against... Okay. Well, I mean, I'm, I'm gonna hit you with some knowledge here. Then I'm gonna bubble burst up on you. I mean, I do mean to burst your bubble. I do. Oh, you can arcane bolt it back? Alright, that's cool. That's cool. Punch combo. Ooh. Nice. Alright, down you go. What else we got? We got a mud cannon. You resist that. Um, I guess we just hit you with some tackle. We got no fire skills right now, so we can't do much there. Punch in the slime. The slime don't care about none of that. Get handled. Tackled. Alright, cool, cool. Cool, 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 cool. I mean, it's pretty straightforward at this point. There's not much left that it's going to be able to do. And you done been had, friend. That's got to be at least a three-star battle, right? No? Man. Like, we, we obliterated the magma pillar, like, immediately. All right. It's like we can have up to six in our group. As your monsters gain experience in combat, they will increase in level. This allows them to gain new skills. You should take a look at the skill tree menu. Yeah, it's on my to-do list. But first, we're gonna, we're gonna pop our egg here. Hatch the magma pillar? Yeah, we are. What? Um... I think we're just gonna call it Maggie. It works for me. It's good. Maggie! Maggie! Alright, and then something about the skills menu? Alright, so we got Mud Cannon. We can get Mud Cannon level 2. Okay, cool, cool. It says Barrier. Apply, applies a buff to the whole. Okay, that's neat. 240, 225, and 220. I say we go this route. 3 times 80, 4 times 55. You know what? I'm going to go in this route. Taunt an ally. When an ally would be attacked, 25% chance to redirect it. Attack plus. Improve attack rating by 1. Huh. Neat. Uh, okay, we've already used our skill point. Everything is set. We're good to go. I. Oh, Maggie's got a skill point. What's up, Maggie? What you got? What you got, girl? All right, um, we just go like straight up to level two. What is this? Arcane bolt. Um, sustain barrier buff, generation buff to a random monster. Hmm. I think I need to go with the arcane bolt. I'm tempted to go double fire, but what if something's resistant to fire? It's just completely wasted. At least here we still have the arcane bolt to fall back on. I suppose shield. I like it. I like it. We can feed them, huh? They already started at level 2. That's interesting. Alright, well, so far I'm having a good time. This is this is nice. We obtained a Cestus. I assume we can equip things. A Cestus. Uh... Increases the attack, 25-25, 30 to 30, and then plus 15 to defense as well. I'd like to see it a little bit more, like, obvious, the comparisons to, you know, what we're getting, but that's cool. We'll give Tommy the love there. Who you be? Hey, fellow Keeper, did you know that every single one of your monsters possesses a special ability? Some can be used to get rid of certain obstacles. Also, you might encounter some destructible walls like the one behind me. Go on, try to hit it with some of your monster's abilities. Hadouken! Ooh, nice. Ooh, a vital ring. That sounds exciting. Who's got the least amount of HP? Uh, Maggie. Let's give you the vital ring. Give you some extra HP. That's what I assumed it did, and I was correct. Hadouken. Alright, what are you going to say? Man, hey, friend. You are just starting as a monster keeper, right? Did you find some equipment for your monsters already? You can make your monsters stronger by equipping them. Like so. I got the kunai. Ooh, 
regeneration on it? What? Oh, sorry, equipment. I'm gonna put it up on Blobbyton Blobber. Alright, the wooden sticks 25, 25, 30, 30 with mana regen. Yeah. Let Tommy be the tank. Huh. Well, I apparently can't jump up there yet. Hadouken! No. Well, I'm a little. Wait, 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 wait. How do we. How do we put. Hmm. So how do we know which skill? Like we have our frog out, right? Can't we like switch to our slime or something else? It's Battle time! Blob, Vero, Vero, Blob! It's just double Blob, Vero. Alright, let's do this thing. Alright, we gonna hit you with some knowledge. Uh, ooh, yeah, we gonna start with you. Alright, we gotta ignite. Weak against is that light magic? I don't I don't think it's it's not fire. Well you are burning, so that's a thing. We're gonna hit you with some mud. Oh, we took you down right away. Very nice. Alright, you're just gonna try to heal up. Alright, that's cool. And there's a slime shot. Going out after Maggie. Unacceptable. Alright. Arcane Bolt. Sure. And I guess we'll tackle you. Boop! Gown. Alright, Slime Shot's coming back. Alright, checking out the Arcane once more. Gonna ignite him once more. He's burning. Gonna hit him with the tackle. And that's it. He's done. Alright. Woo! We got our three star. Yeah! What do we get? Garbage. We got garbage is what we got. I'm not happy with that. Hmm. Interesting. Alright, so if you hit one of your, um, I'm using a PlayStation 4 controller. If you hit one of your, uh, like L2 or R2, it actually lets you switch the different creatures. Keeper's Trail. Man uh, prospered through generations of founded cities and nations, connected by dirt and wheel, and later by steam and steel. Okay. <laughs> Ooh, I made it. Yeah. Ooh, we got a, 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 a racelet. Uh, let's go with Tommy. Tommy looks like he could accessorize a little bit here. Adds more defense and mana regen. What? What was that thing up there? That thing looked cool. Boo! I failed my jump. Got a gauntlet. Alright. Now we're throwing the gauntlet down. Defense and crit chance? Why not? Right, Keeper's Stronghold, left Keeper's Trail. Where do I want to go? The answer is down. The answer is always down. Got some copper. Can't get up that way. Can we Hadouken the wall? No. Sorry, no wall Hadoukens this time around, unfortunately. Uh, I guess Keeper's Trail? Wall Hadouken! Wall Hadouken! No. Alright, maybe we'll get a bird uh, thing added to our uh, mix. Ooh! We're on the right side since we're attacking from the right. That's cool. That's a nice effect. I like that. Alright. Blasting the Arcane Bolt on your booty. Gonna light you up. Ah, I think we just do it this way. I think the mud is gonna be enough. Couple that with the... Uh, the arcane for the next one, I think it's gonna be fine. All 
All right. Ow, ow. Not cool, man. Not cool. All right, so down you go. That's super easy. Simple, sweet, sweet, nice. Styles with a Z. Uh, hold on. Buff info? Oh, that's fine. I'm going to go ahead and we're going to nuke you. I'm going to cook you up a little bit. We're going to mud cannon, and I think he'll burn out. Yeah, he did. Excelente. Excelente. All right, and let's just put you down. Slime with a follow-up from Maggie, and Maggie says good. Mm. Maggie will just burn you out. Victory! Ooh, four star, nice. Nope, we still didn't get another egg, unfortunate. But a decent amount of experience. Alright, man knew of those who wait in the woods and caverns beyond. Yet for the treasures within he longed, for the greed of kings was great. I want I want that. Give it to me. I could just like avoid most of these fights if I want to. I'm not even sure what I just picked up the first time. Um, I think we're gonna get rid of this. We're gonna give you ooh an orb. It's all about magic. Okay. We get the morning star though, but it's arcane bolt. I feel like that's not gonna work out. Sure, wooden stick. Let's give you the orb, maybe? I don't, I don't have no idea. Kunai. Alright, we can get some acid rain coming out. We got bubble burst, we get arcane bolt level 2. Increase our heal. We do slime shot. I think a little bit of acid rain is pretty good. Oh, I failed. I failed my jump. Alright. Enjoy, Rocky. Enjoy. My cook slimy boy here. Boom. Not as much as I was expecting, honestly. Oh, the big heel came out. All right. Put on the slimes and hit me with some leaves. I mean, I'm not all that impressed. Burn for it. He might die to it. I don't know. It's some damage. Nope, not quite enough. Throwing them heals out, alright. How dare you punch my slime! It's more than enough to take you down now, officially. And that's gonna put you out as well. So both of those two are going down right now. Down he goes, burned out. And now it's just slime shot all by himself over there. Just wishing and hoping and thinking and praying and just not gonna work. Alright. Couple of arcane bolts this way, a little bit of ignitation that way. We're burning them up. We're gonna go ahead and hit him with some tackle. And he burned out. It's all done. We got it. I'll take a three star. Hey, we got a rocky egg, a cotton, and a potato. That does not look like cotton. We got double level ups, very nice. And inventory, rocky egg. Adrian! Adrian! You know what? That's fine. We're just gonna leave him as rocky. I like it. What's in a name? Well, lots of things. Uh, I'm just gonna double down on the fire, I think. Uh, what do we got for you, Toms? 
we got for you? You know, increase the attack rating? I don't know about that. Taunt, I'm not loving hybrid minions. No. No. Ah, you know what? Let's just do it. We're on attack plus. Yeah, attack plus. It's a passive ability. I am here for it. Punch combo, leaf combo, spore combo, and restore combo. Alright, get some restorative restorative stuff going. Um, I'm gonna go neutral here. I'm gonna go punch combo level 2. I know, we missed a battle. Let's go back and take... You know what? Let's not take it. Get a little bit further. Let's see what's on the other side of this room. Man plunged into the deepest abyss, forged, attacked, and slew. These endeavors were without solace, the cost of humanity. Or on humanity, nobody knew. Well, I mean... Oh, that's a way through. Boo. Oh, no. Ooh, three phoenix tier. Nice. What is this? Okay. Hello, young monster keeper. Your first time on the keeper's trail, is it? Uh -huh, this is a teleporter stone. You can use it to travel quickly to other teleporters you find. Me? I'm just a treasure hunter. I make a business selling things that I find here and there. Want to buy something? Not really. Yeah, look at that. I came up with a solution. Got the red gem. What's up? Hello, fellow keeper. Did you know that you can change which of your monsters is following you around? This allows you to use different monster abilities while exploring. Yep, figure that one out. Oh, L1 and R1 or L2 and... Okay. So it's any of the buttons on top of the controller does the same thing. All right, that's good to know. Good to know. Well, guys and gals, we're about out of time for this. Hmm, don't have the mountain pass key. Our first look video is coming to an end. I feel like we've accomplished a bit, but I, I want to see more. I've actually enjoyed my time. Oh, he stopped. I've actually enjoyed my time playing this. This, is a lot this has been a lot of fun. You gotta get a little bit of acid rain here, break some armor. You know how we do. Uh, you're weak against fire. Well, got some news for you, buddy. We gonna toastify you, and we gonna tackle you. I suppose I could have used my Rocky if I wanted to, but eh, this is fine. Can we like switch monsters out at this point? Is that a thing we can do? Oh, we totally can. Oh, that's cool. Okay, okay, I see how it is. Alright, that's cool. So we're only gonna get that one attack off because we switched monsters. It actually costs us a turn there, but that's fine. I like that there's more than just like one attack. It's like we don't start with like six hit points. I think it's a much cooler thing in general to actually have this multitude going on here. So we have many, 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 many hit points that we have to actually get through. And I'm a fan of that. Cane bolt's not quite enough. Alright, he burned out. I'm gonna finish this guy off. Get a, get rid of Rocky. Come over here. Bloop! Oh, we don't have enough. Okay. Just gonna restore myself, because, you know, that's how I do. There it is. Alright, sweet, sweet victory. Uh, 32 gold and so on and so forth. Gonna the level up for a slimy slime. It's all good. Or toad into the mix and we've obtained a bandana or a banana. I don't know which. It's one of those things. And what else we get? A skill resetter. Oh, that's cool. All right, ladies and gentlemen, this game is called a Monster Sanctuary. It's been a blast being able to share it with you guys for the last. 30 minutes or so. It's a lot of fun. I like the, the platforming. It's a different pace from what I've seen of Pokemon-esque games, including Nexomon Extinction. Had a lot of fun with that one. Um, 
that that relies a little bit more on comedy. This is uh, just a really well done game. I, I like it a lot. Um, it's a lot of fun. Like I said, the platforming feels good. It plays really well with the controller. Highly recommend you do use a controller when playing this because uh, it just feels right. Oh, I failed. I failed. All right, we're going to go get that chest, and that's going to be how we do it. Anyway, if you guys want more information about the game, where to get the game, information on the developer, the publisher, or any of that wonderful fun stuff, will all be down below in the description of the video and various links and things of that nature, just like it always is. If you did happen to enjoy this video, even if it's a little bit later than, you know, the game released, uh, <laughs> into Steam Early Access, go ahead and leave a like, subscribe, do the YouTube stuff, guys and gals, and until the very next episode when this game finally comes out, again, tell me your thoughts down below. I have been your host, Bumpy McSquiggums. Thank you guys so much for stopping by The Freak Show. And always remember, we play, we fight, we conquer.